That's right, Bill. We're in front of police headquarters, and I've just uncovered some additional information. According to confidential reports that have been disclosed to this reporter only, authorities are about to make an official announcement regarding the possibility of a serial killer on the loose in the city. There have been a total of eight unsolved murders within the last several months whose victims have no links to each other, but sources inside now believe they are connected. We spoke to the lead investigator earlier this week during the discovery of the latest victims, and this is what he had to say at that time. Detective, detective, just a few questions. Miss Keating, how nice to see you again. What can you tell us about your discovery tonight? All I can tell you is we have two bodies, one male, one female, discovered by a man walking his dog. How did they die? Until I have an autopsy report, I'm afraid I can't reveal that information. Do you think it's the work of the serial killer? Miss Keating. Susan, isn't it? May I call you Susan? Susan, what I think is I think it's very irresponsible on your part and on the part of your TV station to be broadcasting such sensationalistic nonsense and alarming the general public. Nobody has said anything about a serial killer. And do you want to know what else I think, Miss Keating? I think this interview's over. Did he leave a signature? Detective, did the killer leave a signature like in the other murders? And who said anything about a he? It could be a she. As far as we're concerned, the killer could be anybody. So you're saying the serial killer is a woman? We've just finished speaking with Detective Pedrosa, who has revealed to us that the serial killer may actually be a woman. We've also had the chance to talk to the man who discovered the bodies.